Oh, hello. This is Tak Chung from Walk with Tak. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If you enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, and share. A Jean came to my cooking class, and she really enjoys stir frying. After the class, she asked me, "Is it possible to stir fry in a cast iron skillet?" The reason is that because Jean recently、uh, received a gift from her grandmother. It is a cast iron skillet that passed down from her great grandmother. It is a piece of a family heirloom, and Jean would like to make use of it as much as possible. Now, I decided I'm going to do an experiment and to test it out to see whether a cast iron skillet will serve as well as a wok.、Uh, intuitively, I don't think it will, but I would like to give it a try. So I can report to Jean: Would it be possible to make use of a cast iron skillet for this particular purpose? And for this reason, I decided to dig out the cast iron skillet that I have had for many years. That was given to me as a Christmas gift. I have no use for it for quite some time, so I had stored it in the basement. And so I went down to the basement. I went through my boxes and found my cast iron skillet. And the first thing I decided I should do is to test, make sure that the cast iron skillet、uh, could be seasoned in the same way as a cast iron wok.、Uh, although I'm quite sure it would be done because I have a cast iron wok which I use quite often, and I season it with my spot seasoning method, and I have no problem in creating a non-stick cooked surface. I start with two tablespoons of canola oil, and this is a 12-inch cast iron skillet.、Uh, because of its size, it takes a while for the oil to spread over the surface of the cast iron skillet. I let the oil、uh, to smoke for about 15 seconds, and this is the time I use normally in my spot seasoning method to season the surface of a wok with a natural surface. So I assume that it works. Pretty much the same way, and we can test it by frying some eggs in it. I'm going to cook a dish that contains eggs and、uh, onion. It's like a scrambled. So first of all, I'm going to sauté the onion. The problem with a cast iron skillet is that it's large surface area、uh, that you、uh, seems like cooking too little stuff in a、uh, skillet of this size. And、next, I add the egg to it again. Like I mentioned, the egg spreads over the surface of the cast iron skillet, and I use my wok spatula、uh, to、uh, scramble the egg. As you can see,、uh, the egg do not stick to the surface of the cast iron skillet. I suggest that the seasoning method works very well with the cast iron skillet. And、the next dish that I'm going to test with the cast iron skillet、uh, is a stir fry vegetable medley. And I'm going to do this in the same way as I would do it in a wok. I'm going to start out by first sauté some garlic.、Uh, this will keep me going. And the first ingredients I'm going to add is some carrot.、Uh, I use the sequential stir frying technique by adding different ingredients、uh, to the carrot and skillet according to how long I want to cook them. Uh, the next vegetable that I'm going to add to the skillet is a combination of Brussels sprout and eggplant.、Uh, both of them takes about the same amount of time to cook, so it is appropriate to add them together. The cast iron skillet does good so far, except、uh, that the stirring is not as convenient as I would、uh, like to be in the case of a wok. As you can see, there's also a lot of splatter onto the surface of the kitchen counter. The last ingredients I'm going to add、uh, is some zucchini. Overall, the cast iron skillet did a really nice job. It's able to、uh, cook this dish without any problem, except the stirring is not as comfortable or as efficient. The third dish that I decided I'm going to cook in the cast iron skillet is a, a pan-fried noodle dish. I start out、uh, with a small amount of、uh, rice noodles. In fact, for frying the rice noodle, the cast iron skillet is superior than a wok because of its large flat surface area. You have plenty of room to fry the noodles, and then I add additional ingredients、uh, to finish up cooking this dish. Now, again, stirring of the content in the dish is more cumbersome. Instead of using a wok spatula, I decided to use、uh, a pair of tongs instead. Again, it works well, but nevertheless, it's not as comfortable or as efficient in the case when I stir fry it in a wok.、Uh, as a whole, 
uh, the cast iron skillet definitely uh, can perform the job of stir frying. Uh, the only thing is that you have to make some uh, substitutions and alter your technique slightly if you stir frying in a cast iron skillet. And splatter is probably more of a bigger problem because if I cook it with a wok, I probably will have almost no splattering at all. But certainly it's not the case with a cast iron skillet. Uh, so to demonstrate the difference between a cast iron skillet and a wok, I went back to my Cucina 14-inch stainless steel wok. And here demonstrate what you do when you cook in a wok and the differences between the two. As you can see, there are significant amount of differences because when you cook in a wok, the stirring is entirely different. The wok is designed for the purpose of stirring, and consequently, the stirring is far more efficient in a wok. And the wok spatula is designed to work with the curvature of a wok, so it provides you much better stirring actions. And this efficiency obviously uh, could not be matched by stirring in a cast iron skillet. However, if a stirring is not an issue, uh, then the cast iron skillet definitely perform extremely well. In this case, I use the wok to make an egg omelet. Without any questions, in a pass iron wok, this would be much easier in comparison to an egg uh, that would cook in an egg omelet that would cook in a wok. So again, it all depends on what you intend to do. Nevertheless, a wok can serve as a skillet as well. Uh, in this case, this is the Cusina 14-inch stainless steel wok. Because it has a large flat surface area, it will allow you to use it like a cast iron skillet, in this case to fry some hamburger. And with some minor modifications, you can also use this Cuisine Art 14 inch stand through wall uh, to make a grilled cheese sandwich, uh, or even uh, to make a piece of French toast. Again, a uh, different uh, purpose of the cooking utensil uh, can be demonstrated by the type of uh, food that you want to cook. And without any questions, a scallop would be much better for making French toast. than. A but when it comes to stir frying, a wok is definitely superior than a cast iron skillet. Because of this reason, uh, I give my recommendation to Jean is that if she wants to stir fry on a regular basis, I will purchase a wok instead. I post a video each day to help you to make home cooking as part of your daily routines. Uh, if you uh, would like to adopt my fast cooking system, uh, please subscribe to this YouTube channel. So keep on cooking. I will see you tomorrow.